term tossed around a lot these days is vegan. It refers to a diet, and sometimes a lifestyle, that doesn't contain any animal products. I don't have any hard numbers on it, but if I had to guess, I would say that most veganism is a pretense. My authority to say this comes from the fact that I was a dietary vegan, a real one, for 10 years. It started as a bet, could my friends and I eat a vegan diet for 30 days? I was the only one who could, and won the bet, but being vegan for even a month is much more difficult than it sounds. I gave up veganism when I got married in 2004, so my wife and I could share more foods, especially breakfast, but I remain a devoted vegetarian. I admit that my diet is at its healthiest when I eat an entirely plant-based diet, which brings us to today's special topic, the holidays. Most of us grew up with very traditional holiday ideas that usually revolved around a meat-based centerpiece. Thanksgiving, after all, happened at a time of year when the wild turkeys had fattened up all summer, or we had fattened up the pigs with our table scraps all summer, and eating one of these animals made sense. But we don't live in that world anymore, instead of using meat as a supplemental protein, we in the 20th and 21st centuries make it more and more a caloric staple. I'll try not to preach and pontificate too much, but now, in 2019, it's pretty obvious that we as a society are eating ourselves to death. Maybe this Thanksgiving would be a good time to give thanks for our health, and eat with that in mind. Many people have set ideas about what makes this particular holiday special, for example, they say it isn't Thanksgiving without a particular item, cranberries, cranberry sauce, the potatoes like their mother made, the pie like their grandmother made, and so on. You can follow these traditions and still be healthy. It's easier than you might think. Eat less. It's tempting to throw caution to the wind on a day like Thanksgiving and eat ourselves silly, but over the years, this has gotten a lot less fun for me. I hate the burdened feeling of being stuffed. It feels, and is, unhealthy. A simple trick to remember is, when you are full, stop eating. Don't worry. The leftovers will still be left over tomorrow. Eat less sugar. I once attended a Thanksgiving feast that was literally 50% desserts. It wasn't fun in any way. Cook, and therefore eat, healthier foods for the holidays that everyone will enjoy. Healthy foods prepared in a festive way sound good fresh fruit salads, robust dinner salads with things like tomatoes and bell peppers, colorful veg 11, CBD infused drinks. CBD oil made quite an impact last year with the hemp derivative infused in everything from sparkling water, lats, and other beverages. Recess a canned sparkling water infused with CBD and Adaptogens is just one company that uses the plant to perk up its beverages. It's hard to say its CBD effects in things like lats, but choosing a product suspended in oil, like coconut oil, and administered under the tongue to my knowledge is the most effective way to work CBD oil into your routine, Glassman says. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to channels.